This fourth video on fund accounting top five questions are on futures contracts. Number one question futures contracts are A. OTC derivative contracts. Option B. Exchange traded spot contracts. Option C. OTC spot contract or exchange traded derivative contract. And the right answer is D. Futures contracts are exchange traded derivative contracts. Second question KH Inc. has futures contracts that are traded on an exchange. The October's futures have lot size is 1000 underlying stock. The KH Inc. October futures price is $45. Can you calculate the contract value? The contract value is it $45? Is it $450? Is it $45,000? Or is it $1,000? The right answer is $45,000 because one contract has 1000 underlying multiplied by $45. That means $45,000. Third question. KH Inc. October futures contracts has 1000 as the underlying. The October futures price is $45. The initial margin is 20%. Calculate the initial margin. Is it $9,000? Is it $200? Is it $9? Or is it $1,000? The right answer is indeed 1000 multiplied by 45 multiplied by 20%. That gives us $9,000 as the initial margin. The fourth question, mark to market, which is often used in futures contracts, is it A, notional valuation of outstanding contracts, is it actual valuation of outstanding contracts, is it realized profit or is it realized losses? The right answer is indeed notional valuation of outstanding contracts. Futures contracts, which of these statements is true about futures contracts? They have a customized settlement date, they have a standardized settlement date, they can have any contract size. Margin is determined by counterparties. The right answer is because futures contracts are traded on the exchange. They will definitely have a standardized predetermined settlement date. All the best for your interviews and do write in with any other topics that you would like me to cover on my video, on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much.